For the second time this season, the Big 12 Conference was forced to postpone a Big 12 basketball game for the Baylor men. The Bears will no longer play West Virginia tomorrow. Nikki Laterillo elaborates on why and how the Bears are still pushing forward after Saturday's win at TCU. Curtis, according to a statement released by West Virginia this morning, the Mountaineers are unable to reach COVID-19 thresholds, ultimately postponing tomorrow's top 15 matchup here at the Ferrell Center. This is Baylor's eighth game that's either been canceled or postponed due to COVID-19 protocols. But because this is a conference game, it will be rescheduled by the Big 12, along with Baylor's game against Texas from December 13th. The Bears remain at number two in this week's AP poll, coming off an 18 point win at TCU on Saturday and despite a slow start the Bears were able to feed the hot hand of Jared Butler and finish with 40 second half points securing its 11th win on the season. Head coach Scott Drew said the way his team plays for each other is what makes them so successful. The players at the end of the day they they do a great job in putting each other first and I um, mean that's a perfect example of a uh, uh, I mean, player-led team, when, when uh, they recognize someone's hot, instead of trying to get their own, they try to feed that guy. Now the Bears will scrap the scout on West Virginia and switch gears to number 15 Texas Tech as they are set to travel to Lubbock to face the Red Raiders on Saturday. Tip-off is set for three. With the Bears in Waco, Nikki Laterulo, Six Sports.